Yes, indeed, it's the Barbecue Cookoff 2014 edition. And uh, Mike, getting ready, doing some plating, and you're still with Chef Neil up here. I sure am. You know what? Come on in here, cameraman Nick, and take a look at this. Kevin and Pat are busy. They're plating. Uh, take a look. The chicken steaming it smells amazing, and you're, you're playing it beautifully. Very nice job. Are you happy with how this turned out? Yeah, it's maybe about as good as we can do, I think, Pat. Yeah, it looks good. It looks, it looks good. Like, we, we've got the um, thigh and the leg ready to go, and it's cooked perfectly. So I think that we're, uh, for the, the limited amount of time we had, I think we did a pretty money job. It smells great. Now, Chef Neil, I want to bring you in here quickly because when it comes to t cooking a full chicken on a grill, a lot of people don't do that because they're a little bit intimidating. What's the, the key? Well, that's the thing. It can burn very quickly. There's a you know a fair bit of fat in there, but uh, what you need to do is cook indirectly. So you have heat on one side of the barbecue, but put your chicken on the other side. Close the lid down, and you'll get like convection action, and and it'll cook. And you know about an hour, hour and a half on on the grill is pretty much going to be doing it. Keep it about 350. Kevin used a stand. Can you just lay it right on the grill, or you should you use something? Flat. You can pop it up on a, on a beer can or, or a pop can or a holder of some sort. It doesn't really matter. Okay. Well, let's check in with Leanne and uh, Andrew here. Uh, or as that I call her, the winner. Look at the plating on this thing Beautiful plating. Here. Nice color. Take a look yeah. at nice this. color. That was the key, was the color. So well, how are you feeling with the finished product here? I mean, I could say that, that lamb, whatever you marinated with that with. It smells great. I think it's going to taste great, too. Now, Chef Neil? key to cooking lamb? Um, not to overcook it really. I, most people like lamb medium, medium rare, um, and, and, and that way it stays a little bit more juicy. So it's a little bit, little bit pink. Yeah, you, don't want it to, you don't want it to dry out on you, right? Andrew, have you ever cooked lamb before? You know, I've never cooked lamb uh, on, on the grill itself. I've used it in the odd recipe in the oven, but I would have been afraid, and I was asking Leanne, and Leanne had a, had a consult with Chef Neil here. I thought, well, you'll get to put it 45 minutes. How long are you putting this thing on for? But the other thing is, Leanne, you were big on the skewers, and one of her philosophies and what she brought to the table was everybody loves a skewer. That's right. Everybody loves finger food. Everybody loves skewers. Everybody loves colors. So here you go. <laughs> so, Chef Neil, you're going to be digging into both of these dishes. Any, any thoughts going in? They both look good. They both look really good, so I think it's going to be a tough decision. Um, we'll see how they taste. Hey, and, of course, up for grabs over here. This is the brand-new Napoleon Grill from Trail Appliances. Someone is going to walk home with this beauty for the weekends. Jill? Fantastic. Thanks so much. Very worthy competitors. And I can assure you that bragging rights will be taken seriously between Andy and Pat this morning. The winner declared just around the corner. And